What up? My name is Anthony Bernino. You better see my gear. Check out my website, trailguiding.com, if you'd like to go on backpacking adventures. Let's get this one going fast. All right, I'm gonna make this fast. So this is what I'm wearing. This is what I would be hiking in. From the top down, got this brim hat, dollar store glasses, neck gator, with this sun shirt uh, with a little hood right here. Protect me from the sun and keep the kind of warm. Uh, yeah, so that, then I got these just regular shorts, it's a nice big pocket right there. Uh, darn tough socks and uh, the Ultra Lone Peak 4.5. I love it. All right. And then uh, I got this fanny pack which contains electronics, a knife, and I'll go into further depth with that in a separate video. My backpack. Oh, let me just flex this. Ooh, yeah. My backpack's is uh, Hyperlight Mountain Gear Southwest 3400. Uh, right here on the shoulder. I got a Sharpie, a hacky sack, keep my phone in here, and I also got an extra bandana in here. Hip belt pockets, I keep a harmonica, extra bandana, extra lighter. Uh, snack bars and uh, and a little magnifying glass for looking at stuff up close and making fires in case. Um, right, in the back, carry this little bowl for uh, water for my dog. So I take him with me. I got this thin light pad from Gossamer Gear, which is really thin. It's like almost nothing. It it got ripped on the first day from like little puppies and stuff. I use that underneath my sleeping pad. Uh, these little things from Home Depot work good to keep your stuff organized. My Z Packs carbon and trekking poles I use for my tent. And also to use them you know, obviously as a trekking pole. Uh, Six Moon Designs umbrella, really like it. It's the 8.9 ounce one, the long one. And uh, got the Bargo Dig Dig. Make it easier to dig holes. You don't really need it. I uh, got this thermo electronic thermometer. Let's start on the side right here. This is my uh, drink bottle that I use with Mio or any type of just to make flavored drinks with my water. And uh, on this side, I keep a little cut off piece of a microfiber towel that I purchased at the camping section at Walmart. A little piece of it. And, uh, Right here in the main part, so this is uh, part of the poop kit. You gotta keep your bum clean AF out there. You don't wanna get a rash. Like what happened to me when I was 11, I learned. Uh, hand sanitizer, I got an extra hand sanitizer on the front. Extra toilet paper, bread bags for your feet. If you gotta take a piss in the middle of the night and you don't wanna put your shoes on. My filter, my water filter is a Katadyne B Free one liter bag, so that's one liter of storage. Plus this, a one and a half. Not Vecto, plus two, three and a half. And uh, we got the two liter platypus as well. So five and a half, five and a half, six liters water storage. Here's that Mio, strawberry pineapple splash, compass. And that's all that, that's all that. I always get inside of the pack. Make this one fast, my four minutes. My food bag, granite gear, 16 liter. Zip sack. Really like it, it's really convenient. My cook kit is a Tokes. Uh, I don't know which one. It's a milliliter, probably like 750. Got my gas, my got a bandana with my Optimus Crux stove, which has been working good. Copper sponge to clean the pot and a lighter to light the stove. And then it's all held within this tote little kit. This is this is my pot and the lids right there. Then I got a more of my food bag. Got the spork. Metal sport from Vargo. Titanium, actually. I got some extra hand sanitizer, Ooh, some candy, uh, extra sport, virology ball shower. Darwin never even used this once yet, but I'm just trying to always keep it away from my dog chewing it up. Right, keep going. 
Ghost Whisperer for insulation in the morning and night. And my duplex tan is a dirt colorway. So let me just show off my little stakes real quick. Real quack. We got these titanium tent pegs, whatever you want to call them. They got a little loop. This one came on top, but there's a little hole on top. These are very multi-useful. You can use it for a lot of things. But I use it for stakes. Okay. Um, okay. Magical bag of goodies. My Thermarest X Burn sleeping pad. Uh, my clothing, my additional layers bag to keep my, my base layers in here for when I go to sleep. Smart World 250 pants, men's and large size. For me, I'm six foot, the large fits. This is also a large quarter zip 250. Marina World, Smart World shirt. Fleece gloves, smart wool, uh, fleece and marina wool balaclava. This is what I sleep in. So. And then my smart wool socks, my sleep socks, and then an extra pair of socks with just some darn tough, cool, foresty socks. It's all inside this, uh, this is also my pillow, so fleece line bag and Z packs. I really like it. This is my med kit, I'll go what's in here, but basically the highlight thing that would be in there is duct tape, super glue, neosporin. Those are like the, the essential thing. Oh, and some tape. Why oh, I say duct tape, but maybe some other type of tape. And also like gear repair stuff. Oh, and the last thing in my bag, right here, my sleeping bag. Inside a Dyneema stuff sack. This is a feathered friend sleeping bag. It's the Raven 10 degree YF material. It's like a, it's not the lightest bag, but I gotta say it's so warm. I've never been cold in it once, especially with that extra. It's in this nice green colorway. I like sleeping bags. As of now, I would probably get a catabatic book, but yo, that's everything, yo. Boom. Thank you for Hello. Here's a video for my fanny pack. So, this is the Versa fanny pack from Hyperlite Mountain Gear. Keep a little lighter in here. This little, this is trash. This little thing, which is just from Night Eyes, from Home Depot, comes in handy. Got a little knife, um, headband, so to keep the hair out. I have long hair, so keep the hair out. And what else I got? I got this little thing from a Leatherman, just to sharpen the knife blade. Just a little thing little sharpening stone thing and then uh in here on top i usually keep my gopro which is what's recording right now and then i got my gopro my charger it goes in this little hyperlight mountain gear stuff sack thing uh, i keep a bandana some uh, z-pack z-line the super thin kind i got nu25 headlamp um, we got this little, that's a rechargeable headlamp. This is also a rechargeable flashlight. Just recharges right here on this plug with the micro USB. And both of them are rechargeable via micro USB. So as you can guess, I got my battery right here. My anchor little, I think it's a 10,000 one. This little guy, been working out pretty good for me. I thought about upgrading to a bigger one, but this will work. And then, um, yeah, then I keep the micro USB, two little micro USB cables. Um, keep an extra hairband. Use this for when I'm in town to charge my stuff. It's a 2.4 amp double charger. Um, for recording thoughts and conversations, I got this voice recorder. Also rechargeable with this micro USB. And then I just carry an extra little piece of paracord, a little one. And a baggie with extra, a little plastic baggie with extra micro SD cards and that's it. Oh. All right, if you can tell I love Dyneema, everything I got like Dyneema, I'm Mr. Dyneema. But anyways, uh, this is my medic slash repair kit. So let's go on the side of it. Uh -huh. Okay. 
I got a lot of random stuff in here. Alcohol pad pads, uh, ibuprofen, super glue. Shout out my wilderness first responder class. A uh, teacher that gave me this is to get stuff out of your eyes or wounds with clean water. This is for some trail hookups. Now I'm just kidding, emergency water holder, whatever you want to call it. Triple antibiotic. Oh shoot, this thing must be leaking. It's all wet. And um, toothbrush. Obviously got the toothpaste in here. Duct tape. Uh, this is this is um, in case you get diarrhea. I forgot what it's called, like Imodium. I forgot what it's called. Some more ty Tylenol. Uh, some nail nail clippers. More alcohol prep pads in case you gotta do surgery out there. Emergency fire kit, just because my dad gave me that. Keep it. Some floss. Um, in case of emergency, a bleed stop. In case someone gets a bad bad cut, use that along with a. Uh, what's it called? Stop the blood with a tourniquet. Okay, and then this is my gear repair kit. And so I got some more glue, tenacious tape, alcohol pep pads, and I don't know exact, exactly what type of tape that is. I forgot what type of tape that was, but I think it came with some stuff. I got some tweezers to pull out thorns and other little stuck objects in your skin. Fishing emergency fishing thing and then uh some toothpaste dr bronner's and what else that's it yep uh, it's kind of extra if i could uh, tell y'all some tips it would just be carrying maybe some medi uh diarrhea in case you drink some uh diarrhea pills in case you drink some bad water it gives, gives you a stomach ache you don't need the pet prep pads i would just say bring the gorilla glue the nail clippers and obviously toothbrush and toothpaste floss for your teeth and um where'd that neosporin go oh here it is yeah so i can minimize it just to like that stuff right there but i'm gonna carry extra hold on thank you for watching